Hello, welcome back. I just noticed there was a key to his villa in here, so... If this is key to his villa... Does this mean it opens every door in his villa? Are you? I'm not supposed to be in here. Um... Um, can we talk? Talk? What business could you possibly have with me? Uh, why are you locked in here? My marital affairs are no concern of yours. Thank you very much. Hmm, what's your story then? I think a better question is, why am I being interrogated by a stranger who just barged into my villa? I have quite enough marriage trouble already, without having to explain to my husband why I'm receiving strange women in private. Do you know what we have here? Preferably the way you came in. By which I mean, please leave. What do you think about the delivery? I think it's about to be broken if you don't hurry up and leave. Fine. I... This is outrageous. Ooh hoo hoo. It is rich. Why is it closed? I just opened it. Ah, now we have a maid to open this room before anything happens. Was it? Hmm. This might be flammable if only they could support my weight. Yeah, if only. I guess this is another way in. Okay, so they are neighbors. Okay, this is... Okay, okay, I see. Something, something we can read. I haven't heard the voice in a while as well. Octavia, ooh. An anonymous friend to Octavia, may the Lord bless and keep you. I am sorry I could not risk discussing this with you in person, but if I am right, then you are a believer like me. You may not be able to worship openly here, but know that you are not alone. If you ever feel like you need somewhere to pray, there, a there is a special place waiting for you deep in the cave behind the theater. Turn right at the first fork and again at the second. You want me to see? Okay. Oh, I wanted to. Okay, this is Priestess's place? Could be anything here. Okay, okay, we'll talk to her. You. Behavior, I trust. Are they? And may Vesta watch over you. I'm Equitia. To what do I owe the pleasure of this visit? I've been asking people about how they wanted up here trying to find a pattern. Interesting. I'm not sure why you're telling me, but you've come to the right person. Did you find a pattern then? What have you noticed? Some people mentioned number lapses. That's true. I know I wasn't entirely sure how I wound up here. What else? Uh, on the National River? Yes. I understand many of our friends were carried here by a river current. What else? And Stranger. Yes, I also had such an encounter. It's as I feared. I think I understand what poor Livia has been going through. Let me ask you this. Did you happen to encounter a stranger in the forest before you arrived here? Yes, I did, I remember. And did you happen to catch her name? Karen. I see. And was this Karen by any chance wearing a hood? He was wearing a hoodie. How could you have known that? Because I've seen her before. There's something I think you should see. 
I think you'd better follow me to the baths. All right, I'll meet you there. But don't follow too closely. We can't have people thinking we're bathing together. Of course. Keeping an eye on things, Horatius? As always, Priestess. Any news about Centilla, Navia, or Kabash? No sign of any of them, I'm afraid. But we do have a newcomer. Strangely dressed woman. I'm How literally like here. The accent too. A traveller from a faraway land, then. Seems that way. Then let's make sure she feels welcome, shall we? Of course, Priestess. It's not like I have any idea where the box is. Help! You have to do something! A man arrived in the bath. I have heard you. Nasty How sort, much would you want with his face all covered up? Help! You have to do something! For the last time, they A man arrived in the bath. Real nasty help. sort, with his face all covered up. And he's got a weapon! What weapon? You have to do something, or he's gonna break the golden rule! I'll get right on it. Thank you. He's still in there. Somewhere. I have to hide. Find me in this empty shrine when it's over. Maybe we shouldn't meet in there. We don't have time for this. I have to go. Never mind. <gasps> oh, buff house. No. We go into the empty shrine. The shrine is collapsing. Are you fucking with me? I'm gonna collapse at any moment. Oh no, the buffs, the buffs. Whoa! Stop right there. I am looking for Tiberius Quinctius Crispus, otherwise known as Quinctius. Do you know where he is? I don't know, a Quinctius? I'm not sure I believe that. That's your problem. So allow me to explain something to you. I am here with orders from Emperor Nero himself to find and execute the cultist Quinctius for terrible crimes against the Empire. So, if you tell me the truth, I will allow you to live. But if you lie to me or otherwise obstruct the Emperor's business in any way, I will put this arrow through your chest. Is that understood? Got it. Thank you. Now tell me, who are you people, and what is this place? Um, we're the small community of strangers who won't up here by accident. A small community. <laughs> yes. I was told Quinctius was a cultist, but I never thought he'd be foolish enough to lead me right to the heart of his mystery cult. What's a mystery cult? Oh, don't play coy with me. I don't care if you're worshipping Bacchus, Magna Mater, or Christ. You lot are all the same to me. Always sneaking off to your secret sanctuaries, indoctrinating each other with your little mantras. The Emperor may have tolerated your activities up until now, but after what Quinctius did, those days are numbered. You've got the wrong idea, we are not cultists. You say that, but if you're not a cult, then why go to such great lengths to keep this place a secret? I just got here! I'm still looking for a way out. So you admit you're not allowed to leave? Uh, well, yes. We physically can't leave, there's no way out. Threatening me is not going to help you. But in any case, that sounds an awful lot like a cult to me. And I saw the inscription saying, the many shall suffer for the sins of the one. I take it this is some kind of mantra you all believe? It's not a mantra, it's a warning. Uh, a distinction without a difference. You've clearly been indoctrinated into this nonsense. Now tell me, where did you lot get enough gold to make all these statues? There were most people who were turned into cult as punishment. Practicing human sacrifice too. You people disgust me. You're distorting what I said. Yes, yes. Because I'm the real villain here. It's all clear to me now. 
the secret sanctuary, the indoctrination, the mantra, the human sacrifice. You are more on cultists. There's no doubt in my mind. What baffles me is how a person can believe in something with such zeal. They just can't see what they've become. However, you still have a chance to redeem yourself by telling me where Quinchy is. I lie? Do not waste it. Uh, what can what's going on? What can you tell me about Quinctus? Very well. Here's what I know. He's a 40 to 50 year old man mm -hmm. with distinctive eyes, one green oh. and one blue. He's also known to have delusions of grandeur. Okay, I know the, the guy. Emperor says he and his cult, your cult, are responsible for starting the fire which burnt half of Rome to the ground and killed thousands in the process. Uh, perhaps the Emperor was looking for a scapegoat. Who are you to challenge what the Emperor says? Were you there? No. Do you have spies and scouts all over Rome, like he does? No, you do not. This is your last chance. Are you going to tell me where he is or not? Mm, actually, I don't where. I don't know where he is. Ah, suddenly it's all coming back to you. No, I just saw the guy you... Yes, he's in the villa right at the end of this road. He was by Malalu. Malalu's by now. Thank you. For your service to the Empire, I'll let you live for Thanks. now. Thanks. But you'd best make sure our paths don't cross again. Hopefully you die. And I can loot your body. Hopefully I have enough time to do what I want to do. We were here. Yes, we've been here. Where are you? Someone up there? Nope. Are there any the other rooms? The many shall oh. suffer for the sins of the one. He killed the guy. Maybe I can get his bow out. <laughs> oh, God damn it. Nothing looks busy, of course he looks busy. I really hope. Wait, right, nope. I really tried taking his bow, I couldn't. Need to get over there as well. And over there! Oh. 
So it didn't go up the bath house after all. Hey, you. Uh, salve, friend. I'm Galerius. Uh, I need to get off oh. this urgently. She's dying. Go fast, hurry, please. Thank you. Now I want to see the yeah. Really? Yeah. Talk more. We haven't talked. Oh, oh we did. Here. I'm so and uh, I hope I'm not being too forward, but the moment I laid eyes on you. I was intrigued. There's a light in your eyes I've never seen before. A certain learning and sophistication. Oh, stop it. Not interested, Why? sorry. Just because I'm a woman? Honey, it's your loss. I take back what I said. Ixian Suddenly, turns. I don't find you so intriguing anymore. Let's just forget that ever happened, so we can at least do business. So, what brings you to my tavern? What's your story? Oh, let it go. Nothing's going to happen between us. You know we are here? You know, normally I'd expect you to buy me a drink before asking if I want to get out of here. I was asking about an escape from the city. I guess that went right over your head. Never mind. As a matter of fact, I do know a way out. I'm happy to tell you all about it, but this is valuable information we're talking about, and I don't just give it out like some cheap oracle. So, how badly do you want it? Is it worth, say, a thousand denarii to you? Uh, if you have a way out, why haven't you used it yourself? Simple. It's a one-way trip, and I'm not ready to go just yet. I like my life here. One day, maybe, but not now. I'm not looking forward to selling 1,000. Isn't it kind of unethical? If all these people trapped in here, knowing there's a way out. I think of it this way. I have something of value, and I'm willing to share it for a price. That's not unethical. That's just good business. Now, do you want it or not? How do I know this isn't a scam? And I'm gonna down write down murder in the sins. I'd be breaking the golden rule, wouldn't I? And I have no interest in doing that. Tell more about what I'd be buying. Well, I can't tell you too much, or you'd figure it out for yourself. But I promise you, you'll never have to spend another hour in this city ever again. I don't have that kind well, of money, sorry. Perhaps you could take out a loan. I understand Maliolus has lent money to others, on occasion. I could. The thing about the golden rule. I just try not to think about it. Drink helps with that. As the saying goes, to drink is human, so we drink. I heard an interesting gossip. Certainly. For ten denarii. Oh god damn it! I don't want ten denarii! How embarrassing for you. Alright, uh, see ya. I guess I have to start stealing then. Poem. My life has been torturous as the seven labors of Hercules, orphan, defeated, and enslaved, yet I would suffer it all again gladly, because each loss, wound, and wound, and tragedy brought me to you. Radiant as Rome's sacred flame, your bright warmth nourishes my soul. I know I can never touch you any more than hold Vesta's flame, but to watch and love you from afar, bathing in your glow, is enough. I'm gonna. I'm not gonna steal. Oh right. Oh, guess whose room it was. Olivia, we talked. Just as the ocean accepts the rivers of all the world, so this place accepts all the souls, but it does not notice the crowds that come. 
What's your story? The bloodless shadows wander without flesh or bone. Some crowd the forum, some the house of the ruler of the depths. Others follow their trades, imitating their previous lives. Sorry, I have no idea what that means. They never do. What do you do? You know a way out of here? There is only a downward path, gloomy with fatal yew trees. It leads through dumb silence to the infernal regions. Do you need help? Help me? You cannot help me. I have seen things. A pattern, a terrible pattern. It is better for you if you remain ignorant. Pandora's box must stay closed. I'll say no more. What do you think about the golden rule? The bloodless shadows. This is their punishment. Well, uh, tell me about the pattern you saw. You think you wish to know? But no, not you really. Do not. I have to. It is better for you if you remain ignorant. Pandora's box must stay closed. I'll say no more. Okay. The newly arrived are ignorant of the road before them. Cerberus lifts his triple head and lets out his threefold braying. Livia! Would you stop muttering like Medea over a cauldron? You'll scare away my customers. They follow their trades, imitating their pre- The many shall oh, suffer I think this one. for the sins of the one. Good night. I just wanted to see something. It was alright. We have to wait for him to get here. Might as well. Guess we can't really do anything near the statues. Hey, hey. Oh, 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 don't. Don't. Nope. Okay, thank you. We have 300, over 300 denarius now. And we can do anything but in front of the statues but we should have we do okay uh, let's see we can create a paradox yeah I can fret creature eh. Right, Nivia. Oh, we talked. Yes, hi, I have something I need to do. Yep, uh, I need to take something of. Uh, she needs this. Go! Just go! I don't want to do. No, I'm not gonna steal. The Phyllis had an order with four girls here and disappeared. Disappointed all of them equally. Oh Really? Oh that's so cute. <laughs> oh uh, it's not cute per se, but really it's cool. Maybe the last but we'll find the city.
As long as it's not stealing, we should be fine. Like I said, as long as it's not, it is not stealing. I have a bad feeling about this. Yes, I can, although you have no idea where you want to leave me. Hello, goatee. Loose eggs. Those will need them. Nope. Maybe they're fine for aromatics. I love it. <laughs> oh, There's a lot of layers to this city. Oh. Salve again, friend. I went and did as you asked, and it worked. Of course it worked. How is it possible that you've just arrived here and you already know everyone and exactly what's about to happen to them? I'm reliving the same day over and over again. Please believe uh, me. You're toying with me, right? Wait. No. You're not kidding, are you? No. That's the only way you could have known. You're a bit like... Oh, what was his name? Sisyphus. Yeah, that's the one. Old King Sisyphus. Kinda. Oh, uh, how so? Sisyphus was a Greek king a long time ago. For daring to think he could outsmart the gods, he was given a terrible punishment. He was forced to push a great boulder up to the top of the hill. Only, just as it reached the top, it would roll all the way back down to the bottom. Forcing him to start over and over and over again for all eternity. Just like you. Yes, and Actually, if he stopped, he was punished even more. Yeah. Stories about the gods punishing people by making them do the same futile task over and over. Tantalus was made to grasp at fruit on a tree he could never quite reach. The Pelides had to keep fetching water in a sieve. Oh, and Ixion was strapped to a wheel going round and round forever. But on the bright side, at least you're not stuck in the underworld like they all were. Anyway. I don't know which god you managed to upset to get yourself. I think I am. Friend, but you seem all right to me. So I, think I am stuck what, in the underworld. I'll keep doing whatever I can to help you. And you just focus on finding a way to break the cycle you're in. Okay, I need one thousand denarii. You're a good man. Oh, that's kind of you to say. Now, I'm the only good man in here. Secret. Although it's not as if I'll remember this next time we talk, anyway, right? Right. Oh, and if our conversations ever start to annoy you, just tell me you're busy. I know when I'm not wanted. May fortune smile on you, friend. Actually, you're quite helpful. Well, I'm not gonna just drag you off. Tell you you are annoying. You are helping me. Uh oh. A fruit he can never quite reach, eh? Hey? I really hoped I could get up there. What? And kind of stand on it, but wait. Oh, I thought there was something beneath. Maybe I will be able to use them soon. There should be a way. Yep, up there somehow. Well, if this was a Skyrim, I could have just jumped all my way up there. Oop. Fortunately, I think this game is a little bit better at keeping player player. Where she doesn't want them to get. And I'm intrigued by that flower. As well. Species! That was probably nothing. Can I? Oh! Can I? Can I? Nope. <laughs> 
I won't try to break the game. I swear. I won't try it anymore. So, for now, that's gonna be it. Thank you very much. Stay alright, and see you soon! Bye!